Some celebrities do not know how to hide the way they feel when they're in public areas or at events, and they just totally react the way they truly feel. This feeling is inevitable, as we are all humans, and our human nature will always pop up once in a while. These are some of the funniest celebrity audience reactions, so watch until the end to see some of your favourite celebrities and how they really feel about certain statements and the way they act in certain situations. This was a cringy moment for Keisha, when she sucked it in and moved on. She was trying to get a hug from one of her favourite co-celebrities, but the man did not only deny her the hug just once, but three times. It wasn't a good gesture from his side, but he certainly can't be blamed if he doesn't want to hug her. It's hard to just sleep when you're tired, because people are tired most of the time. Oh, I love you so much. Oh, thanks. Can I give you a hug? No, thanks. Please? No, thanks. A little one. Yeah, no thanks. Oh. <laughs> Every Beyonce fan would be all riled up to be at her performance, let alone be at the front row, but Tom and Oprah weren't having it when the star singer was performing one of her sold-out songs, Who Runs the World. These two were seen shaking their heads in amazement and trying to understand what the heck was happening on stage. You can still want to be the highlight at an event, even if you're a big celebrity, and this was the case here. Drake won an award and was dishing out appreciation lines to people who came to his mind but he didn't mention his dearest friend. Nikki couldn't help but remind him while he was up on stage. Nikki was captured mouthing, what about me? And the singer also gave her a well-deserved appreciation statement, and the female rapper felt better afterwards. So tonight, I want to say, Vanessa Hudgens, you look incredible tonight. I want to say, I want to say, I want to say, Nicki Minaj, I'm so glad we found our way back because I love you and I could never, ever, ever see it any other way. I want to say, I want to say, little way. Maybe we can all just agree that Drake wasn't in a good mood on this particular day during the event, or he was just following the song's lyrics, like we don't care. Miley was performing to the audience, but he definitely wasn't having any of it, and it was written all over his face. Taylor Swift is known to be one of the celebrities with the most number of awards, but this particular award that she won got to her. She was really happy about it, and she was saying a heartfelt appreciation about dishing out motivational lines to the audience. While she was doing that, one of the women in the audience was really not interested, and her face gave her away as it seemed she couldn't wait for Taylor to get off the stage. You'll look around and you will know that it was you and the people who love you who put you there, and that love you. Drake loves basketball, and he doesn't even hide it. He shows up at the court to watch basketball games all the time. In a playoff against the Pacers, Stucky falls out of bounds and quickly lands back on his feet, but Drake couldn't help but make a sarcastic clap at his back. And then in the playoffs against the Pacers, Stucky falls out of bounds and there's Drake <laughs> with the very sarcastic this celebrity audience reaction is a tricky one, as we don't really know what the celebrity really had on her mind at that moment. However, in the 2018 MTV Music Awards, her name was pronounced wrongfully by Tiffany Haddish, while trying to call her name for a nomination. We can't exactly say if Camilla laughed it off to cover her anger, and she really found the pronunciation funny and laughed about it. Anyways, Camilla Cabellilla. <laughs> Cabello. Camille Cabella is nominated for five. Y'all know I can't read that good, right? I only speak English and that's mostly in Ebonics. Look. How can an award presenter call someone else's name that isn't the receiver of the award and say they deserve the award? Only Kanye West can pull off that type of stunt, and he did. On September 14th, 2009, during the Video Music Awards, Kanye <laughs> The reality TV show can be quite tasking and time-consuming, so when a performer comes on stage and he was jokingly asked if he's had a day job, everyone was not expecting a professional reply. The contestant definitely got the judges and audience's attention when he said he works at a financing company. Do you have a day job? Yeah, I work in Canary Wharf in finance. Do you? 
Justin Bieber got his part broken by Selena, and he had to live with the heartbreak for a while before he finally let it go and became himself again. It was captured in this clip, where Justin was staring at The Weeknd during his performance on stage like an uncountable number of things were going on through his head. We can't blame him for this because The Weeknd and Selena Gomez were dating during that period. Rihanna tends to be the sarcastic and sassy type of celebrity, and she isn't shy to show it anywhere, so no one understands the reason why Rihanna was giggling and slightly covering her mouth while Ariana Grande was performing on stage. The One Direction band made a comment about their best fans being in New York during an awards show. But Taylor Swift didn't feel the same way about the statement. While she was sitting beside her friend Selena Gomez, she mouthed, Shut the F up. Probably they had beef before the show, and she wasn't interested in anything they had to say. We were lucky enough to win three VMAs last year, and there's nothing like the feeling of. Justin couldn't hide his emotions when he saw a girl on girl kiss during a performance he attended. It was really obvious how the kiss didn't sit right with him. Maybe the singer and actor didn't like the two girls that locks lips, or maybe he's just not a big fan of it. Yo, 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 who that be? During one of the Billboard Music Awards shows, the person that was talking with the microphone decided to take a quick snap at Taylor Swift when he pointed to her and said, do not date these women. They will write a song about your ass when you forget to open up the car door. Taylor didn't have much to say other than to nod her head with a sarcastic smile and then shrugged abruptly. Nikki was also caught on camera with her surprised facial expression after Taylor's reaction. Taylor Swift, do not date these women. They would write a song about your ass. If you forget to open up the car door. One of the classy kings of Hollywood doesn't just steal our hearts on TV, but he also makes sure to do it in real life too. Not many celebrities can laugh when a joke is being made about them, but Leonardo happens to be one of those celebrities, the ones that don't get offended when they are being made the center of laughter in a space. In this video, Leonardo laughed when the person on stage cracked a joke about him, and his reaction was a sight to behold. Once upon a time in Hollywood, nearly three hours long, Leonardo DiCaprio attended the premiere, and by the end, his date was too old for him. So... <laughs> Even Prince Andrew's like, come on, Leo, mate, you know, <laughs> you're nearly 50, son. Ellen DeGeneres made the great thought a little bit embarrassed during one of the year's People's Choice Awards, when she put up a shirtless picture of him on the large screen in front of everyone to look at. Chris laughed about it, but it was a bit obvious that the Hot Avengers cast member felt embarrassed in a certain way, as he wasn't expecting such a thing at the event. Be so I would like to share with you, I brought a shirtless photo of Chris Hemsworth to share. Kevin Hart and his friend went to the Venice Beach and couldn't perform some sort of aerobatics, but a kid was able to perform the same thing in a more experienced manner. Kevin went ahead and told him, maybe that's good enough. That's enough, Jackson. Nobody likes a show off. That's insane. Yeah, maybe that's enough. Enough, Jackson. How about we stop showing off? How about that? How about we get it, Jackson? Right. Disappointing you finish. Nobody likes to show off, Jackson. Which of these funny celebrity audience reactions did you like the most? Let us know down below in the comments. And don't forget to leave a like on this video and subscribe to the channel. Oh, and turn on post notifications so you don't miss out on any more interesting videos just like this.